my makeup in the car and I recorded it um, because I find it to be interesting how I do my makeup in the car. I think I do need to fill out my eyebrows some more, but I would have to wait until I stop in, um, at the parking lot. But yeah, it's very simple. Um, it's gotten more simple because now it's hot, it's summertime, and uh, also happy Jumu'ah. Happy Friday, everyone, TGIF. And I have this super cute outfit on. I have on this silk skirt. Um, and then I have on this um, matching um, shirt. And they're both like peach color. And the shirt has like um, stripes in it. And I've been wanting to wear this shirt for a very long time. And I haven't worn it. And now that I have it on, I'm like with my makeup and everything done. I'm glad I wore it. Um, I think I'm going to repack a little. For my trip because I really like this skirt and I bought another one over the weekend at Target and it's longer and it has pockets and it's silky and I realize now that I'm wearing this right now and it's hot how comfortable it is I would regret not taking it and it's a solid color so it'll match with a lot of my tops that I, I am taking so I'm gonna way in advance and then I repack like 10 over 10 times but um yeah I think I'm gonna get to work exactly on time because I left like five to ten minutes later than usual I would that's usually how early I get there um five to ten minutes early so I, today I did something a little different I'm trying to get back on the healthy routine so I brought my oatmeal to have because I've been I was telling Asif that I don't even have breakfast um, he was like, you need to have breakfast, so I think that will do it. And um, I also started walking. I went for a walk with Zane yesterday, all the way around to the school playground. I was sweating, so that's good. I did that. Um, yeah, so it's Friday. We're officially completing our second week of summer school and boy it does it go by fast now i see now i understand why when you start we start the, the school year the first quarter goes by so quickly like because between let's see september october november between september and december it just flies by because you're so busy with so many things that needs to be done like pre-assessments all these things beginning of year things that um it really does go by quickly and and then there is the christmas break that's why that i wasn't hesitant about uh about planning my december trip which i think i um I don't like leaving my house, my home 
of picking up pizza, but I think I'm just gonna go in. I'm just trying to figure out what he's gonna eat when we go in. Because he ate all the bread. And the thing is, I would get him the pizza and he won't eat it. And I made pizza yesterday and he didn't eat it either. And the other day I bought the pizza and he didn't eat it. So he'll say he wants it, but he won't eat it. So I'll just sit there. I think he's eating well at school. That's why he's not as hungry as he used to be. But he's in the habit of asking me for pizza. So I think that's, that's where things are happening differently now. I need a vacation. by quickly so I can relax and be away from this crazy crazy place um, so I was speaking to JetBlue customer service and they're gonna actually be able to book my trip I'm gonna try to go to Hawaii during November when we have off um, what is it called Veterans Day and then we have um, also, is it the conference, teacher conference? So I'm gonna go away for like three, four days and just um, relax and then come back. Then it'll be in daycare and um, I don't know if the older kids will be, they'll still be in school, so.
okay guys so i got to work on time i got here a minute early and i'm almost done with my oatmeal so i'm officially eating breakfast i'm not just having that um homemade latte um i think i gotta go down a little earlier today so i'll go down like in five minutes um i love my outfit today if i go out this weekend i'm gonna wear it again so i organized my ela math health and i was working i think on social studies a little bit my baskets just to get rid of things clean out what doesn't need to be there and put like things together and i had a um i think my ela bin was like the most i needed organizing so i also used a um a binder to put everything in order according to beginning middle and end of the year and that nature and things that i can use throughout the year for example, I have a current events, multiple copies or versions of how they're going to um, do their social studies. And I really like the current events idea, depending on like if we're talking about immigration for that quarter or whatever, however long we're, talk we're discussing immigration, they can just simply go online, find articles or a video about the current events of immigration like what's happening and just fill out the five w's this one for example has key vocabulary the title topic author date publish the newspaper or website whatever they might have used and then they're going to summarize what happened and draw a picture so i thought that was a great way for them to do homework for um for social studies and it's just one per week so they have more than enough time to to work on that so i'm gonna go up uh, go down now and i'm gonna actually use the bathroom first and then um i'm going to go and um have breakfast with my kids or have my students have breakfast but yeah that's the dealio i will talk with you later bye Probably not. I eat. You're itchy? Oh, it's warm. It's yeah. oh. Huh? You know how to do your feet? And out? Bath, mommy. You're welcome, baby. I want bath, mom. You want what? Bath.
there's no ticket. Harder. Let <gasps> <Yay>. me <laughs> um, help you. Okay, that's why you have your jacket on. It's okay. Now you see why we give baby jacket. Did he go under? Uh -oh. I do it again. The most scary day of your life. Hey, what's that? Blow Oh, I thought this was make noise. Blow, blow it out. Let me see what you're doing, Momo. So scary. <laughs> so scary. You want to do it again? No. <laughs> you want to do it again? 